Taurus, welcome to your weekend love read for the 25th to the 27th of October. All right, so I put up a poll around the express versus the extended readings or normal readings. Um, and it was kind of pretty even. So what I've decided, and there were some decent comments around why people liked each. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to try doing express reads for the weekends from now on. And then the weeklies will get that longer read because there's more days as well. All right. So we'll see how that goes. Let me know what you think. Um, but for the moment, don't forget to like, subscribe um, and comment. And let's get started for your love messages for Taurus, please. Love messages for this weekend, 25th to the 27th of October. Thank you. Oh, two coming out. Oh, wow. No, three coming out. Oof. All right. So. Oh, goodness, Taurus. All right. So you've got the death card. Hang on. I'm just going to fix the camera. Hold up. Okay. That's better. All right. So what you've got here is the death card in reverse, six of cups in reverse, and the hangman in reverse. <laughs> So I kind of feel like maybe there's been some sort of, sorry, someone was revving their engine outside my house for some reason. Um, so it looks like maybe there's been some sort of falling out with um, someone you have a really strong connection with. Now, these are love readings, but they can sometimes mean family and friends. I'm feeling like this is um, maybe someone that was a really close friend that there might have been some blurred lines, so a friend with benefits maybe, but this is like, it's like you've jumped in too quickly to this fight. Um, but you've got the death in reverse. It could be a Scorpio that you're dealing with. Let's keep going. Let's see what else they've got for us. I feel like I'm, I'm kind of sensing that... Um, it's like there's been a knee-jerk reaction to something is what I'm getting. Okay. Ooh, oh, so many cards coming out today. All right, yeah, so Nine of Pentacles and the Five of Wands. All right, yes. All right, so it's possible that... Um, uh, it's possible that because you haven't wanted to be alone, it's moved from a friend's kind of situation to something more but that's actually not what you wanted and you've kind of gone along with it because it's better than being alone that's the, you've got five of wands in reverse nine of pentacles in reverse um and that's kind of it's almost ruining your real friendship because now you're in this relationship that you think you're great friends but they want more you've kind of gone along with it but it's not really what you want to us for some reason yeah, because it's not, you know it's not what you want and it's becoming a toxic kind of thing that it's like the more they try and fill your cup, the more they just can't. Like it's, an, it's a forever empty cup and then that's just making you guys resent each other, them resent you, you resent them. Um, okay, what's the most likely outcome for Taurus this weekend, please? Thank you. Okay, justice. All right. And the Wheel of Fortune. Okay, so whatever is going on here, it's all about to change. And it's going to it's going to be something that's even out of your control. I think it's all just going to get taken out of your hands. Um, and a decision is going to be made. Probably a fair decision, the right decision, which, you know what, if you're not feeling it, then, it, you know, you need to be honest, yeah. And it does look like you guys might come out of communication for a little bit, so there might be some blocked communication um, after this wheel turns. So just be aware. I'm not sensing that that's a permanent thing. I feel like this is just going to be a, like a temporary just put some distance between you both to sort out your head um, because, yeah, I feel like it's one of those situations where you're really close friends and then you mistake it for something different and then it all goes bad when you sort of hook up. Let's see what advice we've got for Taurus. Yeah, okay, so you're not offering anything extra to this. Anything else, please? Advice. 
Yeah. This has kind of come as a result of you still healing from something else, I think. And it's it may be that they were watching you go through a hard time and that's kind of how it turned into something more than friends. Um, but you need to, yeah, you, you're trying to avoid this doing the work to heal from whatever's happened in the past, basically. Um, and that's why this sort of stuff keeps happening. So you've got to focus. You have to go back to whatever it is that was hurting, like really hurting you, that's made you afraid of being alone. Um, th that's kind of the key over here. You need to go back and work through that because you're just going to keep repeating cycles until the universe believes that you've learned your lesson kind of thing i don't like delivering this message this is not my favorite message today taurus i'm sorry oh there's that person yeah because you're going to continue to be kind of mourning all you know the past until you learn to process it so you're going to have to go back and process it you're going to have to face whatever it is because this world is just going to keep repeating cycles that are going to force you to look at how you interact in relationships. You have the death on the bottom of the deck again. So it could be very strong Scorpio energy. Also remember we're coming into Scorpio season now. So it could be saying that this is the time to process that stuff. This is the time to revisit um, what you haven't processed yet or what, what you kind of swept under the carpet and thought, mm, that's a problem for future me. You need to deal with it. Now is probably a good time to start. What uh, advice is there for romance angels, please? I just saw release your ex pop out. So it's possible that this is in relation to an ex. Trust. The situation is calling for you to have faith. And I feel like you kind of don't know how to get out of this situation. Um, yeah, I think that'll be the title. Uh, because you don't want to hurt anyone. And I feel like you don't want this aid of aid of wands in. You don't want this communication blockage. Like you want to go back to being friends or whatever you had. Um, but I think you just need to trust that the, that will work out. I think after a, a short period of separation, I think it'll work itself out. Um, yeah. All right, that's what I've got, Taurus. Uh, please like, subscribe, comment. Let me know what's going on. Uh, and I will see you for the weeklies. Talk soon. Bye.